Hi, Sagittarius, and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast. This is for February 10th through February 16th, 2020. We don't have a whole lot of astrology going on this week. Um, we're under the influence of that Leo full moon that we just had mo more than anything else, so all about manifestations. But um, Sunday, Mercury does go retrograde in Pisces, and Mars moves into Capricorn. And we'll go more into that energy in next week's reading, but um, as it's more impactful to next week, this uh, week we do have Valentine's Day though, Sagittarius, so happy Valentine's Day to each and every one of you. I am wishing you so much love, so much happiness and blessings this week. And we will start your reading off by pulling a card with an Archangel and see what Archangel is working with you, is guiding you this week, who will help you out. All right, we have Archangel Michael and I am Presence. So, Sagittarius, Archangel Michael coming in, and he is the angel of truth and personal empowerment and breaking free. So this week, um, I am Presence. This is, to me, where there's awareness coming to you about a different people, situations, or relationships in your life where you're seeing things more from that like Neptune retrograde energy. Neptune's not retrograde right now, but that's like how I see you this week. It's where um, rose-colored glasses come off and you see things for truly what they are. There's no illusion about it. Um, there could be a bit of, you know, disillusionment taking place this week, but it's like um, for your personal empowerment in any way that that is unfolding. And it's all about truth, truth of others, of situations, as well as truths of yourself that you may not be aware of that you need to um, come into an enlightenment about. And also, um, I really feel strongly like a liberation and breaking free, like truth and awareness that allows you strength um, to move forward, to make a change, to break free from something. So um, this week, no matter what's going on, Sagittarius, reach out to Archangel Michael. He will come in strong. He will help you. He will bring you truth. He will bring you clarity. He will bring you um, encouragement. He will bring you bravery. He will help you reclaim your personal power. And he will use his, uh, you know, sword of, power and strength to help cut you free from anything that's oppressive and holding you back. So let's pull some more cards. All right, I must have put that in wrong. We have the ring coming through. So this is about a, a commitment, a union, or a cycle finally coming to an end for you. Next is the mask, um, things hidden, now coming to light. And look at that, two and three. So that's a progression, all right? Um, in, there's protection um, with this mask as well. Okay, so know that and that protection comes from Archangel Michael next out We have the lady so this could mean there's a feminine energy involved in all of this or you could be a female Sagittarius, it's just really hard to define that specifically in a general reading for all and now we have the hat So this is you taking on a new role of some kind um, you know a promotion also and so, Sagittarius, um, this week, some of you, um, it might be time for you to get a promotion, to apply for a higher position, or to apply for a new job in a different company entirely. If that is the case, you know, a spirit says, now is the time. Don't hold back. Believe in yourself. Push forward. Archangel Michael will help you with that confidence and that courage if that's what you need. All right. And um, also um, help empower you to really speak your truth and move forward. Now, um, also for others of you, this ring and this mask, um, along with Archangel Michael, it's like you are coming to the end of something, um, a cycle, a relationship, um, a lesson, a situation, just something in your life. It's been in a cycle and now it's coming to 
an end and the enlightenment is now coming into your conscious mind and it's like um, where you were in the space of observing which is learning through the mask now you're transitioning into wearing the hat like you are moving in to a different role Sagittarius somewhere in your life and it's due to this cycle ending you've learned you've gained all you can from it um, whether it's situational it's um, relationship you know it's different for all of you you're coming to the end of that and Archangel Michael is helping you with this transition as you move into this new role. All right, and we are under that Leo full moon energy. So you are feeling very empowered. Emotions could be running high in a lot of different people in this week, including yourself. So just keep that in perspective. Let's pull some tarot and dig deeper about this new role, this cycle coming to an end, the truth, the empowerment. We have the eight of beetles. So yeah, you've you've learned, you've grown. It's time to expand into that, um, like all that awareness, all that wisdom of experience, like to expand into your conscious mind and become a, a big part of you. And next out, we have the two of moths, the four of moths, The strength card and so yeah that's that Leo full moon energy coming in strong this week and the six of dragonflies okay so Sagittarius yeah there is shifting this week and um, you are being very empowered it may be that you need to stand up for yourself somewhere and really speak your truth and um, no matter what not be shaken be a force that cannot be knocked over, all right? Especially if you're fighting for a dream or something that really means a lot to you. It's like, you know, let nothing throw you off um, your balance this week. You have Archangel Michael with you for a reason, and that's because you're meant to be victorious. You're meant to be empowered. You're meant to get that clarity. You're meant to speak your truth. You're meant to hear truth this week, and all of that is to help you know, bring that wisdom through all the experiences that you've been going through into that conscious mind, which really restores some balance within you. Okay, like I said, you're with the mask, it's like you're watching, you're observing, and it's not to say you're not experiencing, but to me, I was feeling that as like you were learning, and then you get that with the Eight of Pentacles, you were learning, and now it's like everything's changing, and it's time to put the hat on, because you're experienced now, um, you have the proper credentials, and it's like before in the past, you weren't ready, but now you're ready, Sagittarius, and you know, if, if this is about you really speaking your truth, and holding your ground somewhere in the past I don't feel that you were mentally or emotionally um, strong enough at that time but now you know coming into this week with the energy of that Leo full moon Leo being a fellow fire sign really empowering you making you strong Archangel Michael coming in as well encouraging you supporting you giving you the sort of power to cut and break through of any sort of deception any sort of um, like distortion of view of perception because like I said I felt that um, like Nep Neptune um, retrograde energy where you just see things a hundred percent for what they are and you do and it comes from that soul wisdom deep within you um, that has that you have earned through everything that you have been going through different experiences and it's time for you to stand up for yourself and push forward you know and believe in yourself if you're reaching um, for a higher position or a new job or a big change in your life really believe in yourself Sagittarius you've got this you are absolutely a hundred percent ready for whatever this means for you personally any sort of big change or shift and I am present Everything you've been through, it's like now hitting you um, like a ton of bricks this week. And it's like um, you feel like your intelligence like just really kicks up out of nowhere where you're like, damn, 
I really am smart. And it's just because of all this wisdom through your experience incorporating into your conscious mind and you're going to start operating from that place and that's also putting on a new hat. You see things differently. You've grown. You've advanced. And um, so empowered this week. So if you need truth, you need some encouragement, you need to be brave, you need to be strong, call upon Archangel Michael. He will have your back in a second and help you out with that. All right, Sagittarius, let's pull some advice. All right, well, these two flopped out, so you get two. First one is boldness, and it says, don't take this lying down, get up and fight, but fairly. This fight will be remembered because of the respect and dignity you bring to the battle. There you go, Sagittarius, don't back down. You have the strength of the lion through the um, Leo full moon, as well as Archangel Michael really having your back. Next out is love, and it says... Before you can truly love another, you need to open your heart and allow yourself to receive love first. If you open your heart to love, it will flow into your soul. And this coming out as the other advice is, you know, what doesn't honor you, what doesn't serve you. And as you see that, like that disillusionment this week, um, Archangel Michael coming in to give you that strength, that boldness to say what you got to say, to do what you got to do, but do it with grace. You know, don't let anybody lower you because you deserve love. You deserve um, reciprocation, all right, in, in any relationship or experience or circumstance. And Archangel Michael's helping you see that this week and giving you the strength and empowering you to do what you need to do because the cycle is now coming to an end and you're, you're shifting into your wisdom and you're putting on a new hat. So... Those are your messages this week, Sagittarius. I am wishing you all the best. Take care.